Hey everybody, um, so something just came to my attention, which for me is an indication that, you know, it's from a most high source and it's something I, I should really share, so I'm going to do that. Um, <clears throat> you know, uh, just one more thing to clarify for, you know, as far as like, you know, the ways of doing things and, you know, why the 42 laws of my aunt, especially in the most high way of doing things, um, is uh, the, the type of spiritual protection that comes with that is a most high level. So, you know, that righteousness, that mission, you know, it's all about saving the children and the earth and each other and all of humanity. But in order to do that, we got to set the example and put off that type of a vibrational, energetic force. Because there's going to be things to try to get in the way. It's just the way it's going to happen, man. Um, and this is where you're, you're, you know, having faith is very important and knowing what you're standing for. And, you know, it's... It's some serious warrior shit, to be honest. I mean, I know it's just talking about, you know, growing plants and stuff, but you have to realize to the enemy, the hemp plant and coming together in these type of ways is, like, the ultimate weapon against them. So, it came to my attention that I should, you know, share with, you know, whoever is, you know, curious about what I've been talking about, that, you know, those type of forces will, you know, be doing what they can to stop this. So, it's... And another reason why it's so important to be about that most high love or just taking care of life as well as you can, you know, is really what it is. You know, life is in you and everything that your life is around all the time. You know, that's how you get your spiritual powers. That's how you get your spiritual protection. And it is true. Like, I've, there's things that have happened to me. <laughs> I don't know if I've shared it, but it was in New Orleans when I was on my trip. Um, you know, and uh, Joshua and Adam of Joy... <laughs> They were playing football back and forth, just tossing the ball. And I was sitting at a table, um, kind of an awkward angle, and especially where they were playing football, because it was like Josh was kind of like underneath this patio thing, and it wasn't much space, and Adam was in the backyard, and they're both, you know, they like to fuck around, so they throw that shit hard. And um, <laughs> I w my intuition was like, you know what, I'm probably not sitting in a very safe spot, but I was kind of shy, and it was and it was their place, and there really wasn't anywhere else for me to kind of sit, and they were in the middle of throwing it, so I, I was like, I'm just going to sit here, and hopefully nothing happens. Um, but sure enough, that ball came flying <laughs> right over my direction, and um, I kind of turned in my head, like a little bit, but it, it should have hit me, apparently, and it didn't even hit me. Um, and Adam actually was like, whoa, that was a spiritual deflection, you know, and you know, and again, I'm not saying this to try to brag or anything. This is just me admitting uh, a testimony. I mean, this shit is real. Like, there is a spiritual protection, and it is about your energetic vibration. You know, if you're really on that righteous path, you're going to have that righteous energy. Your son's going to be at a higher level to be able to deflect and also send out. You know, I mean, there's all different types of things. You can, that's not, you know, protection. That's something different, but... Um, the protection does have to do with, you know, wh how you're operating and, wh and what level you're vibrating at. So, um, but again, you know, just to share with you guys, like this type of a movement is going to have these type of resistances. So it really isn't for anybody who's not serious about the work because it is very serious work. You know, I talk about partying and stuff, but, you know, the work's got to be done. You know, th it's okay to have fun and everything. You got to do it respectful and stuff like that. But, you know, this work is very serious. So, you know, time and place for everything, but when it comes to the work, it's just got to get done, and your heart's really got to be about it, and, you know, for me, it's something that, you know, I, you got to kind of be willing to die for, because it's, I take it as, like, a soldier, like a servitude, you know, that's why I have spiritual warrior training and, and things of this nature, so, you know, if you're really trying to be about this, then that's where, you know, I think it'd be good for your head to be at, or at least be prepared to be around that type of energy, because it is very serious and powerful, you know. So I'm saying it's God energy, it's God speed. So a type of resistance is going to have to counter that, you know, so you're dealing with some serious dark shit. So <clears throat> anyway, I right, love you all and hope you have a good day. All right, bye.